got our hands on a mugshot of the man caught doing something we can't even fathom. Stealing from the wreckage of a fiery and deadly crash in Maryville. And it's hard to even look at the images that the charred rubble left behind near 59th Avenue in Thomas. Yeah, the road's just reopening now after being closed for hours. And ABC 15 Sonu Wasu has been out there all day long. Sonu investigators say a tow truck driver is to blame for all of this. Yes, police say this man ran a red light right here at 59th Avenue and Thomas. He was heading down 59th. We know that he works for Western Towing. I just called the company. I'm told he's, this driver suffered a concussion in the accident. He has worked for them for about a year out here at the crime scene this morning. Police did test all of the drivers involved for alcohol or drugs. All of that's still under investigation at this time. And take a look at this video of the fiery crash taken by a man as he drove up to the intersection. This is just before 5 in the morning. He describes it as chaos. Also a feeling of helplessness knowing there was a man inside that car on fire. I didn't know how many people were in that vehicle. Honestly, and it's just sad, sad that some, 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 someone lost their lives. You know, someone's brother, mom, dad, you know, sister is gone now because, you know, someone can't slow down. Police have not released the name of the man who died. This accident tied up traffic in this area for hours. Coming up at 6, here from drivers who were caught out here because of all the barricades. Also, more from witnesses who were out here, saw all this happen, and those who tried to help. Back to you. Yeah, just a horrible thing to witness. Thanks so much, Sonu.